Hey guys, friendly neighbors, and welcome to Block 29, MCM, London, October 2017. I know, I know, I'm not due for about a year, the doctor told me so, but this blog is going to be absolutely amazing, and you, Hello, whoever you are, the doctor warned me about you. What do you mean? Oh guys, we're just a bit out of time. <laughs> you pathetic lot that we call that I call. Good morning everyone, it's uh, Friday the 27th of October and it's the first day of Comic Con. Lost it out. <laughs> Feels weird. Go you. Um, yeah, obviously you can tell. Top and the dogs is in the wrong colour. Um, I've gone down to breakfast now and I'm going to tune to Cannon Town. I don't know, I'm changing there. Let's get replacement bus service. Because the main things still closed and shit. Apparently it's supposed to be a tube strike tomorrow, so God knows what time I'll get there. Uh, but yeah, today's gonna be fun, photos, footage. Um, and I will see you all a bit later. Bye. Morning everyone. It's about eight o'clock. I've arrived. You know, I'm just around the corner from the Excel actually. Uh, I've got a Royal Victoria and it turns out it doesn't open until 10 o'clock so I've got two hours to kill. Don't know what I'm going to do. Um, but it's just gone 10 past 8 so got about an hour and 50 ish. Um, so you just don't know if we make out but just in there. I'm going to take see it. That's the O2. So I'm not that far away from the O2 really. Um, I might get a coffee, wake up, um, and then just go from there really. Uh, so I'll see you all a bit later. Bye. Okay guys, um, I've just arrived as you can probably tell. And it's ridiculously early. Um, I'll just quick tour around. Uh, it's for the noise someone's cleaning. Uh, over there. This is where I'll be going on Saturday night. Um, yeah, I can't actually go until 10. So I'm just waiting around. Well, hour and a half. Um, so I'm going to do a lot around, do a little bit of photos and shit. And that's pretty much 
shit that I'm doing today. Because my two photos are tomorrow when I've got to check in tomorrow as well, so it's going to be fun. Unless you can drop the case off tomorrow morning and just head round. Um, yeah, so I'm just kind of chilling out now. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I've done like a shitload of selfies on the way, so keep me occupied. Um, that's pretty much it. So, I'll see you in a bit. So today I've got my two photos. Um, I've just dropped my bags off at the hotel. Um, so I'm not going to get my Anthony Mackie photo. Um, I've just got it off too. So I'll probably miss the Who photo shoot. Well, I might pass it on later. And then probably go in later and just chill out. Uh, and I'll probably get those photos done as well. So I'll see you all a bit later. Bye. Hello and welcome to the end of day two. Um, as you can imagine, it was a lot more busy today. Um, so I got more photos taken. No, I didn't actually. Um, I took. Oh, I don't know, seventy-five. That's all together. I took quite a few yesterday, and I took a fair few today. Um, I'm actually staying in the Ibis Styles opposite the hotel. I'm not actually staying on the site of the XL. I'm staying opposite. Uh, I've had a couple of pints already. Uh, a couple of ciders, had a strong bow, had a magnus. I've got four other cans of cider. I'm not sh quite sure what the name is, but it's cider anyway. Um, yeah, so I've got my photo with uh, Anthony Mackey, aka Falcon, aka Papa Duck. Or, to put it another way, this guy's a gangster, his real name's Clarence, and Clarence have a home with both parents, and Clarence's parents have a real good marriage. Yeah, so I went a bit freestyle rap there. Um, yeah, um, so I kind of did a mini bit of that <laughs> when I went to get the photo of Anthony. Um, uh, so that was fun. Um, had a photo with Andrew Scott. My queue, the queue that I was in, was the queue to the queue to the queue. So I was waiting quite a while. Um, there were some wicked costumes. Um, I actually saw a Dumbledore, not a Michael Gambon Dumbledore, a Richard Harris Dumbledore. And I didn't end up taking a photo, and I really peed off that I didn't. Um, so I've got like lots of shit around my mouth, which is not good. Um, Met loads of uh, Doctor Who cosplayers today. Um, someone who was cosplaying as Missy. I cannot remember what her name is for the life of me. Um, but I met her at a Torchwood event this year. Early this year. Oh my god, I can't believe it's nearly over. This year is over already. Um, sorry, rambling. Um, so. I guess right, Crystal D, I think her name is. She's the one who does the Doctor Who fan show. Um, you might have seen. Oh, and you, there's a YouTube thing. Um, check it out. I'll put I'll link to that in the description bar below down there. Um, 
that, took loads of photos, um, had a laugh. Um, Ollie was dressed as Durrani again. If you've seen the photo um, and are slightly concerned, don't worry, it was one of my mates dressed as Durrani because he said he was going to do it. Um, I'd never actually seen someone got so much dedication for that costume because I'd never seen anyone cosplay as Durrani and it was just absolutely bang on. Um, so that was fun. Um, Will was a uh, Roger Delgado master today. Had a little shrink or de shrinker, whatever it's called. A shrinking device. Um, Lisa was Joe Grant. Oh, oh God, too much to count. Um, bumped into Michael from Iconic Legion. Um, we all we had a pint in a restaurant next to the Fox, so that's kind of cool. Uh, one of the guys was having a pizza, so I was having his pizza. Um, it was like a red hot pizza. It was it was rocket with chicken and some sort of peppercorns or spicy herbs or chili. Any anyway, it was hot. So. Uh, that's essentially what happened today. Um, it was absolutely crazy. Um, now, obviously, I'd have also already mentioned yesterday. Um, me and Jason were supposed to film something yesterday, but sadly, um, you know, he didn't have the key to his parents' house because basically his parents went on holiday last minute um, through lastminute.com. And he, the unit costume for the flashback it was at his parents' house and he didn't have the key, so we couldn't film it. Um, you know, for the David Bradley talk, which was on, to, which was on today, you know, came over, apologised, and I said, Look, it's fine, it's fair, you know, don't worry about it, you know, these things happen, you know, and we agreed that we'll rearrange, we'll get a whole lot of props in and do something, which would be great. Um, now, funny thing about the David Bradley talk. Now, for those of you Star Wars fans out there, there's a little reference to this. Um, towards the end, um, he was mentioning Louise Jameson, who's a friend of his, who plays, um, and for some, for some reason, she plays Leia in Doctor Who, alongside Tom Baker. And he referred to her as Princess Leia. Oh, the faces that me and Tim, not me and Tim, faces that me and Will pulled were like oh you did not I basically lost it I laughed um, so yeah that was quite fun um, and he was talking about his experience playing William Harnell and playing the first Doctor as well so essentially he was playing the guy who played the first Doctor in the Adventure in Time and Space documentary TV documentary, which was on in 2013, and he's also, if you haven't seen the trailers, where have you been? If you have, you know, he's playing the first Doctor, alongside Peter Capaldi. Now, there's a rumour, I don't know how true this is, and I really should have asked, um, <laughs> I don't know how true this rumour is, but apparently there's a rumour going round that Matt Smith has been spotted on the set of the Christmas special, which kind of would make sense. Um, because Matt made a cameo at the end of the documentary when I think he was doing the last shot as William Hartnell as the first Doctor um, and it would make sense for him to be in it towards the end of Peter's last moments so so have to wait and see. Um, I want to chill out. I'm probably going to have a drink a couple of cans of my cider, if I'm honest. Um, what did I get to do? Well, I didn't really get anything. Um, I just chilled out with friends, had a laugh, and it was great. Uh, so... Yeah, we were discussing um, Ian Richard Tarrant, who cosplays as the master as well. 
you know, we were discussing you know, the master's costume and everything, and the shirt he got, he got his shirt from Costalgia, I think it is, which is it's a company that's based in New York, because you can't get any more of the shirts in the UK now. So, or I think it was something like $89 of transfers or something like 70 odd quid. And it's quite expensive for a cosplay shirt, but, you know, considering it's part of the master's costume, it's probably worth it. Um, and that is it for day two. Um, I'm going to be around Comic Con for a few hours tomorrow. That's Battle Damage 10. And that's going to be MCM Comic Con. I'll. I will definitely, definitely, I know I said this yesterday, but I definitely will try and get some footage done. And most likely I will do. Because I, I haven't got any photo shoots to do, so why not? Um, so I will see you all in the morning. Bye. Hello everyone and welcome to Comic Con, the last day, day three. As you can see, I'm all tanned out. Um... And the time part two, I won't do all the fake blood shit. So, I'm going to be around for a few hours today. Uh, I've got a train at 10 to 3. And I need to leave at about 2. So, around for three hours. Uh, I won't be able to dick the other this night, so I was knackered. Um, so, obviously, if somebody picks her around, and see you later. Bye.